Bilførere stilles løpende overfor valg. Hvor de ser kan bety en ulykke eller ikke. Vi har en veldig vid area av vision. About 90 degrees on each side and a little less than that uh, above and below. But only a very small part of that is accurate vision. About the size of a quarter held at arm's length. And that means that if we want to really look at something to see what's happening, to see if the pedestrian is starting to move across the street or to see if the light is turning red, we have to look right at the thing. We see they fixate uh, for a brief period of time and then zap, they fixate somewhere else, zap, fixate somewhere else. And each of those fixations takes about a third of a second. And the reason that's a problem is that we are moving so quickly. We're moving at about 40 feet per second just in this uh, city traffic area. And that means that a third of a second, in a third of a second, we go this distance, I'll show you. And that's just to glance at the traffic light or glance at the pedestrian. Let's say we see something that makes us want to stop. Then we need perception reaction time. And during that time, just to get our foot on the brake, we travel this far. Okay, now we've got our foot on the brake, but we have to bring the car to a stop, and that takes about this distance. So you see, it's a very long distance just to respond to an unexpected event, the pedestrian that suddenly uh, steps out in front of us.